Okay. So, right. So, today, Arjun, we are going to do about culture and civilization. Yes, in our exams, we have section D, right? So, we have to do the culture and civilization. And what about the France? We are going to learn different things about the France, right? Okay. So, you know anything about France? You want to share something about me, anything about France? No? Okay, you know about the hexagon. That's wonderful. That's we are going to learn the first thing only. Yes. Wow. Oh, wow. Wonderful. Arjun. So, you know much about French language, right? Okay. So, I'm not going to waste the time. I'm going to start my topic. Okay. And today, we are going to learn about La France. La France. You know? the French country, the France country, it's a feminine country. That is why I have used la, la France. Okay. So, the next is, here is the map of France and we are going to learn on some major cities of France, some important rivers of France, the seas. The, the France is surrounded by different seas. That we are going to learn the names of the seas and the uh, countries. It's surrounded by on Tourne Par Sea Spay. It is surrounded by six countries and one country is a neighboring country that's in England, but it's, it is not touch the boundary of the France. There are six countries which touch the boundary of the France border, but the one is England, which is a little far. Okay. So the next. Here we have the different things that we are going to do. The first is your Le Montagne. Le Montagne. The mountains. The mountains of the France. We are going to learn 5-6 mountains of the France that the question is definitely come in your exam. Le Fleuve. The river of the France. Okay. So there are river of the France. Le Fleuve. I repeat, Le Fleuve. Fleuve is your river. Le Pays Voisin. Le Pays Voisin. Yes, Arjun, you are correct. It's Fleuve. Pays Voisin is a neighboring country. Le Mer. Le Mer. Mer is your sea. Bonjour, Akansha. Welcome to French class. Yes. So, how are you, Akansha? I hope you are fine. Okay, Trevia. Welcome to French class. Okay, so you have just joined. I just revise with you what we are doing. Yes, doing about France, the cultural and civilization of France. Okay, so here we have different things that we are going to learn today about France. Okay, great. So, the first is Le Montaigne. Le Montaigne, Le Fleuve, Le Fleuve, Le Pays Voisin, Le Pays Voisin, Le Mer, Le Mer, Le Vie, Le Vie. So yes, we are going to learn about the mountains of the France. Different mountains of the France, different big rivers, huge rivers of the France. We are going to learn the neighboring countries of the France, the seas. Uh, the France is surrounded by different seas. So, yes, we are going to learn the name of those seas and the major seas, the metro cities of the France we are going to learn today. So, Les Montagnes, Les Fleuves, Les Pénoisins, Les Mers et Les Vies. Okay, so the first is Le Montagne. Le Montagne. I have given you five different mountains' name. 
so that we have to learn with spellings and with the definite articles because in exam it will definitely come so learn it okay the first le vogue le vogue le jura le jura les alpes les alpes okay a yeah, great massif central le massif central les pyrénées les pyrénées okay i repeat les vogue les vogue le jura le jura les alpes les alpes le massif central le massif central les pyrénées les pyrénées so please do learn these names of mountain that will definitely come in your exam in your essay 1 culture and civilization so and don't forget to put these accents in pyrene these are the mountain mountain and mountains oh. next we have the neighboring countries of the france les pays voisins les pays voisins these are the neighboring countries of the france do you know that we have the which touch the boundary of the france on tourne la france and there is one neighboring country in land which is, which doesn't touch the france but it is a neighboring country of the france okay so the first is longle terre longle terre longle terre is england right so england is one of the neighboring country of france which doesn't touch the boundary of the france but it's a neighboring country and the rest six countries it touch the france boundary the second is l'almagne 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 it's a germany l'almagne l'espagne l'espagne it's a spain spain is also one of the neighboring country of france it's a le pays voisin le luxembourg le luxembourg do you know that luxembourg is a masculine country that is why we have used l e definite article le because luxembourg is a word it's a masculine word la suisse la suisse suisse it's a switzerland and that because it ends up with e do you know that rule yes we call you all your rules that the countries which ended with e are feminine countries okay so switzerland is your feminine country la suisse okay the next is l'italie 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 it's italy and it starts with a vowel so we started with we use the l apostrophe l'italie la belgique la belgique again the country is ended with e so it's a feminine country we use la la it's a the definite article so we have these seven neighboring countries whenever in an exam the question comes no me le pays was in the the la france so you have to write all these seven countries i repeat one more time and don't forget to learn the spellings because why you are writing in your exam teacher may make deduct your marks if the spelling is not correct longle terre longle terre l'almain l'almain les pain les pain le luxembourg le luxembourg la suisse la suisse l'italie l'italie et la belgique la belgique i hope it's clear to everyone so these are the neighboring countries of the france les pays voisins this is l'almagne so l'almagne it's almagne germany l'almagne okay great thank you so much okay so next is the metro cities of the france the major cities of the france i have given some cities and uh, for your knowledge i want to tell you that there are 27 regions in france and every region has its capital 
So now I'm going to share you some cities of France. The first is Marcy. Marcy. In French, I double L is silent. So it's Marcy. Marcy. Toulouse. 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 Lee. Lee. Again, your I double L comes, so it means it's silent. So we just call it Li. Li. Pari. Pari. Bordeaux. Bordeaux. Nice. Nice. Lyon. Lyon. Okay, V. These are the cities of the France. Lyon. Nice. Bordeaux. Pari. Li, Toulouse, Marcy. Right? Okay, so please learn all these capital, the cities of the France. Okay, here now we have the rivers, the river names of the France. And yes, these are the some important rivers of the France, huge rivers. That is why we call him Le Fleuve. Le Fleuve. The first is La Seine. La Seine. Yes, Seine is your feminine river. So I have used the La. La Seine. La Garonne. La Garonne. Le Rhine. Le Rhine. Le Rhone. Le Rhone. La Loire. La Loire. Okay, so here we have three feminine rivers and two masculine rivers. So don't forget to put the accent, the definite article and the accents also. I have put the circumflex over O. So this comes in the spelling. So don't forget to put these accents. And we have three feminine rivers and two masculine rivers. Rin, a Ron are the masculine rivers and the rest Sen, Garon, a are the Feminine. And we have one more trick how we learn masculine and feminine. That if the word, if the river starts with R are masculine and the rest are feminine. Okay? Okay. So the next. Here we have the seas. The France is surrounded by different seas. Learn the name of the seas. Le mer. What we say seas in French? Le mer. Mer. La mer. Yes, would be a correct. Le Mer, la. Mer is feminine to be, so we put la. Okay? La mer mediterrane. Mediterrane. La mer mediterrane. Mediterranean. Loncio atlantique. Loncio atlantique. The Atlantic Ocean. La manche. La Monge.